Yo, hi guys, Kevin here, welcome back to Forza Horizon 4, and we are going to be doing today the gauntlet, which is the other way from where we're going, so <laughs> let's spin it around, and let's get going, we're still in our Lancer from the last episode, really like this Lancer, it's a, such a nice car, like, it handles so nice as well. Like you just can't complain with this answer but yeah we're gonna do the gauntlet which is i think is like a really 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 long race that's what i've heard anyway so could be a bit crazy could be a bit dangerous <laughs> um but we'll see what but one thing i will do quickly is i've got my unfortunately i've got my logitech wheel set as really high sensitivity because I was drifting on a set of course last night um, so let's bring it back down down like uh, and let's go back into the game yeah that's better okay the wheel feels absolutely normal now Perfect windows. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the last video. Starting to get the wheel settings dialed in a little bit, which is nice. Always nice. But yeah, really enjoying this game at the moment. One thing I will say, I'm not enjoying it for drifting at all. Like drifting, I just can't, can't, just can't do it on the wheel. Like it just doesn't feel right. Like, force feedback's awful. Uh, I just, I'm going to keep practicing. I'm going to try and get there for you guys, but at the moment, I'm just enjoying driving like this. Enjoying the game for... Oh, God. Enjoying the game for what it is at the moment. I don't want to force drifting on the channel when I'm not doing very well at it. But we'll see how it goes. I'll update you guys on that as it comes along, but as you can see, out of winter now. Nice to see. No more snowy roads. Probably a good time to do the gauntlet, actually. And doing it in the snow, that would have been crazy. Turn left. Yeah, this Lancer is nice as it sounds beautiful. Looks beautiful. Turn left. That was a bit heavy into that corner. Yeah, we're going to be doing the gauntlet. And apparently this is a really long race. I think it's like the last off-road race, I'm pretty sure they said. Something like that. That is something to look at. We'll have a look see how long it is. Here we are. We are here. We are at the gauntlet. Let's run the gauntlet. <laughs> it don't sound too good, does it? Can I please use this car? Come on. Win-win situations. I hope that's not... We, we will see we, we will see if that's sick uh, but yeah into the race a little bit of revs up and go right into a sharp corner here so i'm just going to ram up the inside of all these people thank you very much okay my headset wire is completely in the wrong way uh, i'm going to try and ignore it Oh god, that bump be right off. I couldn't get breaking because I was busy flying through the air. Oh, oh I missed it. Damn you. Might as well just restart, I know. But then it's a very long race. Like where's it where's it finished? Ah, let's not restart man. Let's try and tear it up, catch up with these guys. So yeah, not the best of starts there to the gauntlet. We just absolutely missed the checkpoint, which is not ideal. Not ideal at all. I'm going to keep trying to dial in my wheel settings, that's for sure. It definitely feels a lot better than it did the first few episodes. Uh, but I'm going to keep adjusting. Keep, keep playing this game because I really enjoy it. I just drive it about at the moment. Like the drifting, not the biggest fan. 
but we will get there. Yeah, we're catching up already. Get to smash it into here. Uh, one thing this car is good at is straight lines, so we should be able to catch up on the tarmac like this in a straight line. Come on, get that speed down. We're catching up now already. I can see, see how much we're catching up. Going into a sharp left corner, left hand corner coming up, which is nicest. Took that quite well. I'm quite surprised how I took that. I normally take the sharp corners really poor. Keep this going. Side of Lushism. Let's go. Everyone's going really slow around that corner. Got to capitalise. Everyone's sort of ramming up the inside here, and I've decided to join them. I don't know why I've decided to drive right up that guy's ass, but it happened. Yeah, this is a weird section, this. Like the motocross sort of track, I assume. Like all the bumps just completely throw your car like in a way that shouldn't be going. Oh no, I'm snapping. Hit the brakes, there we go. Throw it back to life. Um, so, we're not doing the best here, that's for sure. I do apologise for the quality of ratings, racing here, but we're trying to get used to the wheel. Like I said, it's slowly coming back to me. As you can see, I'm still a little bit sloppy. I kind of overcorrect. Not ideal. I keep moving all the sensitivity around and all the settings around, like it's not, not doing to be honest. So we'll try and get this car in a straight line and get this speed down like this. That's a nice little corner there. We're only 30% through the raid, so I can't can't be too upset. We're still in touch. Yeah, I had that inquiry earlier where I missed the whole bloody checkpoint, but. Other than that, we are doing okay. I can't complain at all. Got a habit of just driving up people's asses at the moment. And it again. And it again. We got past that guy. Come on. Let's go a bit, bit of speed down. That was a bit dodgy. Jump into the corner. Direction in. Here we go. We're in first place. So if I don't make any mistakes, I should win this quite easily. I, I think I'm on like the second from highest difficulty, which is a bit crazy seeing how so far behind at the start. Now I've caught back up with first place, but we'll take that. It's a long race. I mean, it's more about just being a long race than the quality of opponent. It's a bit of a weird line. Hit the barrier most probably. We didn't. This is a little technical around this section. I've not really taken the best lines here. But we move. We're back onto the tarmac. My leg, my leg is hurting. We're getting fatigued. Did that quite nice. Only hit the brakes a tiniest little bit, which is good. I did see the red braking line. Might have to hit it there. That's a little bit tighter than I think. That was nice. Nice little corner. Nice few corners. It's going. There's nothing stupid. You know me, guys. Uh, I do very stupid things. Oh.
Hey, we're, yeah, we're in full concentration mode right now, and as soon as I start talking, crash. We actually got the guys behind there catching me up. Maybe I was taking it a bit too easy to do that. But I'm glad that I did, because I normally mess up sections like that. A little bit understeer. Uh, understeer, under sorry. Right? Down. Guys behind are catching me up. I do not like this. I'm getting nervous. I get nervous. I do stupid things. Doing okay though. Can't complain. Staying in front, which is nice. I think it's these like fast corners. They're so much better than me at these fast corners. I feel like I'm taking them okay. That's not the best line really, but okay. We move. We move. And we keep moving. We keep going forwards. Oh, I thought I missed the gate then. Put that corner a little bit tight. Oh, well that was a nice corner. I like that. That felt really this one as well. Took it. Took these corners. Oh, we're doing quite well right now. I'm happy with how I'm racing. Obviously, it could be so much better. I already messed up at the start as well, but I feel like I've warmed into the race. Watch something stupid happen now. I start talking myself up. I will be watch this. Okay, so we're eighty-two percent through the race. Quite a long race, actually. But not as long as I thought it was going to be. Chickens in the way. Sorry, chickens. Might have killed a few of you there. We're off road now. This is where something stupid is going to happen because I'm an idiot. Okay, keep going. Keep going. I right, go straight. I thought that was going right there. Oh no, I feel like we're going to die at some point here. One thing we have got is quite a nice lead right now, so I can take it a little bit easier than... Put in different situations. Oh, the grip is not, not here right now. Like I'm fighting the car to stay like straight. Definitely my settings aren't there yet in the wheel. Like it feels it definitely feels better. But they're not right. Go through the water. What put me left there? Around that one. Come on. Us back onto a tarmac road, please. Oh no, we got three percent of the race left. This is what this will be where I mess up, no doubt. Doubt about it. I mean, I'm taking it so easy. Here we go. Yeah, buddy, we won the gauntlet. Look at that car, dude, buddy. Ah, slap trade in second as well. Love to see it. Yeah, buddy. That was nice. I really enjoyed that. Definitely enjoyed that. So, one thing I will say from those settings, it didn't feel right, but it felt better. That makes sense. So, we have been promoted level 9 dirt racing here. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but pretty sure that was the end of the series. Pretty sure. Oh, we got some silver canvas shoes. They're not going to get in place with the wellies, but wellies are good, man.
So yeah, we've done that. Hey, Kevin. So let's just quickly jump into the settings here. Let's have a look at my controller set. Let's go over to wheel. One thing I do want to do. No wonder it's not on the custom wheel profile. That's why the shifting is working how I wanted it to. Uh, but that's fair enough. But if we go, that's probably why the force feedback feels strange as well. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Idiot. All right, what we got? Um, so there is steering uh, linearity as well, which I have left at 50. I think that's default. But that's all the way down, which is minimum pause. This is the trail line tool. Scales the build up of that we like. Let's down that a tiny bit. Or speed back understeer. Up that. Bit. Or feedback scales. Okay, let's try that. Um, so we've got the right wheel profile now. So when we press the right shifter. Alex tells me you're back from the gauntlet and that you're Horizon's new dirt racing champion. Yeah, we're what? dirt racing champion, man. Yeah, handbrake is now there. That's perfect. Ooh, that felt nice. I think just generally on the tarmac, like the wheel does feel. It's when I go off road, but maybe that's just I think I've got to get used to. What have we got here? Speed camera. Oh, I just please just slow down. I thought it was something else. But yeah, let's tear about the roads. Let's see what's see what's going on around here. Woo. We are flying into gear six. Oh no! Oh, that mini just died. Oh no! Oh, so sorry, mini man. Mini man. Oh god, I'm gonna die. You see, I went to them. Um, Itch my nose at the very wrong situation there. That's for sure. Oh, itchy nose coming through. Yeah, I don't know if this feels good yet or not. I, I don't know. In terms of throwing it sideways. That, that kind of feels okay. Felt okay in the wheel. I think, yeah, I think that understeer feedback is thank good. Because it automatically throws your wheel. Like, that could be good for drifting. It automatically throws your wheel the way that you kind of want to. Yeah, it kind of counter steers for you. Quite nice. But yeah, we'll, we'll see about that and stuff. But let's grab this sign. Where's this sign? It's somewhere over here. In the bush. We are in the bush. Bushman. Bushman coming through. But where is Sign? Sign, where are you? Oh, of course, it would be right there. Slap it in reverse. Yeah, buddy, that's how you get a sign in style. Another sign down here. These are signs that we need to do all of this. <laughs> Definitely have not picked up many signs. Oh, oh it's going to be under the bridge, isn't it? Painful. Yeah, this, this definitely feels better. Even in the water, that felt better. Oh, I'm not fighting against it, I'm fighting with it, which is nice to feel. Where will this sign be? I'm assuming it's on the top. Top is it? It's gonna be on the top. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that gauntlet. Sorry for the quality of rating, but I am getting better. Oh, it's up there. How the hell do we get that one then? Got to be a ramp somewhere. Hopefully, just have a little turn. There. How do you get to that? 
Hmm. I can't go through the barrier. That is just marvelous. How do I get to that? Hmm. The ramp this side. Maybe I have to ramp up the side of the like bridge. That makes sense. Well, that could be how you do it. Like if I was to ramp. So oh, sorry, feet at five hundred. If I was to ramp from like this way, oh, uh, that's the wrong angle. Oh, here's the here's the ramp. <laughs> Open your eyes, you stupid little man. Don't know how much speed I'm gonna need. Let's just go back from like over here. Oh god. Uh, I can see I can see the line in the. We've definitely got the line there. <laughs> I kind of need to come down this road to be honest with you, because that was not a good line to get to. Uh, come from like, oh god, this is not the best driving right now. Any apologies? Yeah, maybe enough speed. Woohoo! Oh, that's too much speed. Oh no, we died. Rest in peace. Rest in pieces. Okay, so that was far too much speed. So we kind of just need to go from like here. I'm gonna go from here. But like this is what is the perfect spot. Is that too much? No, we got it. Yeah, what a, what a ramp, what a rampasaurus. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Yeah, we're going to call it a day here. It's been really good. I quite enjoyed that gauntlet. Uh, sorry for always adjusting my wheel in the th things, but it's going to be part of like the process. I need to be doing a lot better. Thank you very much for checking this video out. Now give it a thumbs up if you can. Guys, in the next one.